I will first start by rinsing my chicken very well under cold water and then I will drizzle the chicken with olive oil. You can use any oil of choice and then I'll just simply with my hands just kind of make sure the chicken is coated with the oil and then we'll add the first ingredient which is liquid smoke. This is by far my favorite ingredient on any of my meats. <laughs> I could just load this on. Then we'll go ahead and season with some seasoning salt, onion powder, black pepper. With my fingers, I will toss this again and making sure all the seasonings are evenly distributed on the chicken. And I almost forgot my paprika. Cannot forget that. I love to add this to my chicken for color. I'm not letting any of that seasoning go to waste, as you can see here. <laughs> and I'm making sure that all of my wings have the skin side up before I place in the oven. And lastly, I'm gonna add a little bit of parsley flakes. I will now place these in the oven at 450 degrees for about 25 minutes. It is 25 minutes later and this is what we're looking like. They smell absolutely delicious. I have drained the juice from the pan and now I am going to add my barbecue sauce. Now I am going pretty generously with the sauce. My husband is a sauce man and we just love the taste of barbecue. So add as you would like, but we add quite a bit. I can't even estimate how much we add. And we're just gonna brush that on. And I want it as even as possible, so I'll move some of my wings here and make sure I'm getting some sauce underneath and on the sides. Yep, and I'm adding more sauce. Oh, this chicken was so, so, so delicious. Okay, I have put my final coat of barbecue sauce on, and now we're gonna place this in the oven at 350 degrees for about 20 minutes. I almost forgot, but please place foil on top this time before you place it back in the oven at 350 degrees for about 20 minutes. Make sure you add that foil to keep that moisture in. I also placed a few slits in the foil. And 20 minutes later, this is what we're looking like. This chicken recipe was so, so, so delicious. My husband absolutely loved it, and I've made it three times already in the month of March. Here we have it. Doesn't it look amazing? I hope you enjoyed this video, and until next Monday, have a great week. Bye-bye.